frozen burger patty review. Meat versus meat. Okay, so today we have great value at Walmart brand. 100% pure beef burgers, 85 lean, 15 fat. So we'll look at this. It's actually low on the sodium, only 4%, which is a good uh, indication. That's always good. Ingredients, 100% beef. That's uh, also good. Walmart is really trying to step up the game. We'll go ahead and put these on the grill and figure out if these are worth buying or not. All right, welcome to another frozen burger patty review. It's the PA. Today I got my man Tony, V, and a special guest. Paula, how are you? Good, good. All right, yeah. look at those glasses. Looking good, man. You try, look like I a try. secret. I you you look like all. an undercover agent. All these yes. handsome guys. All <laughs> right. <laughs> Today, we're going to rate some burgers. It's the uh, Great Value. It's a brand from Walmart. Uh, 85 lean, 15 fat. The last burger we had like this was the Aldi's burger. It was the Aldi's burger. And how Came in the same packaging too as a plastic. Yeah, so Walmart has different brands. They have a red brand, which is like 75, uh, uh, 25, and all that stuff. So this is the leanest one. And they're really stepping up their games. The ingredients here is just pure beef and a uh, little sodium. Only 4% per patty. So let's dig in and let's, uh, let's, let's, uh, let's rate this. It. Not bad. <laughs> yeah, well, the perfection looks good. Yeah, the cook just right, nice and juicy. Has a very similar taste to the Aldi's burger, actually, it does, actually with right. the seven, with the eighty-five fifteen. I'm beginning to think it's the same. It's the same company that makes it. Yeah, the same is. Yeah. I think it's this same. is the same burger. It's the, the same thing. The packaging is the same thing, like you know. <laughs> this no. must be a conspiracy. <laughs> same bag. I mean, it's the same taste. It is the same taste. I feel yeah. like we're eating Aldi's for the second time. Does it say a Walmart or no? Yeah, it's yeah, great great value. Value. Walmart. Yeah, it's yeah. Walmart. So they just uh, man, this tastes very, very yeah. similar to the all these burgers. Whoever makes it, probably makes it for both of them. We gotta research it. Yeah, they just put their own label on it. This is a decent burger. I, I gotta tell you, wow, yeah, very good. Walmart is stepping up their game. Not only can you get filet mignons there now, you can get good beets, good fish. And they're really trying to. Even their clothes, they've improved their they've clothing. They've improved their clothes. I think you know they. they I, you know, people say what they want to say about Walmart. Uh, department for TVs. Every, they have everything. Well, I, they have to compete with yeah. Amazon. Yeah. People, Amazon being so big and Target. People can say what they want to say about Walmart, but I think they're really trying to make a difference as far as their product and stuff. Evidenced by the the fact that this burger is 100% beef and it tastes really good. I mean, 85 lean. <laughs> we have a, a a baby on the sidelines today. <laughs> And uh, V's got to attend to that. By the way, I don't know if people realize this or not, but uh, my friend Paul over here is a marathon runner. How many marathons have you ran? Too. Nine. Boston, Chicago, New York, uh, Berlin, LA. Portugal, Lisbon. Yeah. Wow. Uh, the Washington. man actually ran from his house over here. <laughs> Listen, this guy does so many marathons that he doesn't drive anymore. He runs to work, he runs back, he runs to the store, he runs back. All he does is run. He's like this. What's the, uh, Forrest the, Gump. Oh, the Forrest Gump. He, he's, he's like Coyote or Forrest Gump. <laughs> Forrest he's Gump, like Forrest yeah. Gump. All he does is run. He doesn't walk anymore. He doesn't take a drive. Yeah. Just walk. He just runs back and forth. That's all he does. And good thing, you're not running anymore, are you? Still running. Still running, but you're not doing a marathon. No rest. So you can eat these burgers yeah, all you want. Yeah, exactly. Now, uh, and drink up. Cheating time right now. So <laughs> eat the burgers, have some beers. All right. Let me process another one. Let me get another half here. I mean, I think, uh, I mean, these are cooked perfectly good. A little uh -huh. red, not yeah, too that's, much. That's yeah. what I like. Like, the last six weeks, my God, they've been, like, good. Really good burgers. I'm very impressed, like, lately. With, with the... How with juicy it is for the... Uh, juicy as heck. 85.15. Yeah. yeah, they did. And, like, we came to this conclusion that when it's leaner, it doesn't indicate a dry burger. It's actually the opposite. When it's too much fat, you can overcook the burger. Exactly. And the bread, the bread as well. With this yeah, where's the, the bread, bread man? This guy brings bread every week, fresh bread. <laughs> Oh, From my bakery. Yeah. What a combination. Yeah. Good burgers, yeah. good chef, good bread. Yeah. Oh, the yeah. Way bring. Good Come beer. beer. <laughs> uh, I brought a kid this time. I usually bring some kind of alcohol. There's a kid in the side. <laughs> Today he brought a kid. There's a kid in the sideline. <laughs> I just brought my expertise. No, right. But yeah, this is an Aldi 8515. I think this is the same thing. It tastes just like it, yeah. Last week we had the ballpark burger. Sodium, yeah. we call that the sodium burger. <laughs> this is a but let me tell you, Paul, when I watched this video, I noticed like even when you were grilling, what a difference from like they were already like cooked. It's well, like, they were cooked, but anyway, 
That was a soda part. They were pre-cooked, were they? Were pre-cooked. Yeah, they were. They, they were. They were. They were. Yeah. You, could yeah. you could microwave them. But I noticed when, oh, when right, I saw man. the video, because he was the only one who was winning, and when I saw him, I'm like, oh my god, yeah, it, it's like it's they're already done. <laughs> just Last just, week we had the sodium burger, this week oh. we have a bologna burger. It's a flat disc, but it's good. Yeah. It's but not a quarter pounder, say. but okay. it's, a, it's, a, it's, it's nice. The next time say. <laughs> After these messages, we'll be right back. Yeah. All right, process the burger. Eat it. Let's see what we have here. I'm gonna do just the uh, uh, burger with no bun, just to get a little bit more feel for it. Mhm. Mm it's important not to get the bun in there and mix it with the flavor. I'm gonna be really, really accurate on these. Yeah. This is what number eleven. Number eleven. Number eleven. Still first season? Uh, to be season two is season one, yeah. <laughs> season, season, season two is the wieners. Yeah, wieners, alright. <laughs> Last week, as you know, we had Marco over here. And I gotta say this. Marco the man. His mustache compared to yours, you have a manly mustache. I mean, that is like, you are like Kojak right now. You know what Kojak is? You're like, you're like, it fits your style. I love it. Okay, when you're pouring tea in the home, the Three months. No, let me ask you a question. Do whatever you want. Then you go out, put a mask on. The you must season. be really taking care of that beard, yeah. of that mustache. <laughs> no, you trim it because yeah, you have right, more time. Yeah, you're in the quarantine. Yeah, yeah. Now, yeah, actually, I did. Uh, I trim my shape today because I want to. You want to look, look good, presentable nice, for the video. Let me ask you a question. Special, special. I know that you're taking care of it up here. What about down there? <laughs> what are you doing down there? Are you taking care of that as well? <laughs> What happened to V again? We lost them. I we know. lost our soldier here. <laughs> as long as you don't lose the burgers. Oh. Uh, all right. All right, so he's back. He had a little babysitting side duty to do. But he's back. He's back. All right, so I think we, we, we uh, can establish uh, can start establishing a score here and rate these burgers. Uh, Tony, go ahead. It was good again, so uh, very juicy, moist, and uh, like we said before, it looks like almost like the Aldi's one. It tastes like so, the Aldi's. So I think I'm going to give an 8.75. Paul, go ahead, since you're uh, the guest here, let us know what you think. You look like you, you've had a burger, you know how to rate a burger. I don't know what your impression of this is, but let us know. No, it was very good, like, uh, cooked to, like I mentioned, cooked to perfection, juicy, like the, there's some really good flavor in it. So. I agree. Really, one of the top burgers I've had. So. One of the top burgers, man. You have it. Jeez, this guy's a thick burger. I mean, this is one of the top burgers you've had. I didn't say it was like the best burger, yeah. but it's wow. like no, the best burger. Wow. No, you said it's one of the top burgers. It's really those bologna burgers. Jeez, all right. Those butter balls. Yeah, it's really good. What the hell have you been eating? Have you been eating our best home style? I know, you want to impress me to get it, you have the best burgers, but no, it's really good. It's like this. It's really tasty. I'm definitely going to give like probably eight and a half. All right, go ahead, V. Um, let's get back to reality. <laughs> yeah, so I, I liked it. I like the taste. Um, very similar I, to all it's these. It's very similar to all these. It's lean, which I always look for the lean. Low sodium is good. It tasted like beef. Um, and you're not going to go to the bathroom? No, good. no, I feel good. Um, and I, I don't remember where I gave the other one, but this one is probably going to be... I'm going to go with an 8.0. Um, just because the, the 8515 really gives me an extra half point. Yeah. For me, I like it that it's low in fat. Yeah, I, I know um, some people prefer it. It's actually a healthy burger. It's not. Yeah, bad. it's it's really good. good. I, mean, I liked it. Yeah, 17 grams of fat, yeah. which is yeah. not overly bad for a one patty. No, it's not. So you gave you gave it an eight. I like. Yeah, I'll go with an eight. All right, that's good. I think this is reasonable scores. I think uh, some of them at the end here are a little too high, <laughs> but uh, I mean, I, you know, this guy says it's the top burger right it's here. Not the top one. Uh, the top rookie, man. the rookie says it's the top <laughs> burger. It's, it's the best <laughs> burger he's ever had. But if it's good, why are you gonna give him uh, a score? If it's good, it doesn't well, make no sense. I mean, sense. this is not like. Well, I'm gonna tell you, this is not a, a, an 8.7. You, you want to have some fat in there, like in the burger. Like yeah, you just exactly. Want, like a nice. Right. Otherwise, you get a steak. This, this, this. You, steak you gotta, it's really steak. good. All right, let me let me get in my score here. Right. So I'm gonna give this burger. The reason I'm gonna give the burger the, the score I'm gonna give is because of the fact that it is a bologna patty. It's a small patty. Uh, it's not too thick, but it is juicy. It is 85.15 for an 85.15. It is all beef. You can really taste the beef. It's a quality burger. 
for sure. It's not a, a horrible burger like we had last week with the ballpark. <laughs> it's a really good burger. They're a little skimpy. I mean, they're not false advertising. It doesn't say quarter pounder, so, you know. But it's a little thin, and it's a bologna patty. Uh, it does taste good. I don't want to, you know, I, I don't think it's the best burger I've ever had. I think the uh, uh, the uh, Bubba Burger grass fed was, was tasted like this, but fresher and juicier. Yeah. And it was bigger. Sorry. You get what I'm saying? And it was it was a lot thicker. This is a great burger. If you're having a barbecue with your friends, it's relatively inexpensive. They do have uh, one below this, which is the 75, uh, 25, I believe. So let me just take the final bite here because I cooked these to perfection once again. Mm, I'm really... I mean, it's a good burger. It's definitely an Aldi's 8515. The company must be the same. I don't know what I gave Aldi's, but I think I might have given them around this score, which is what I'm going to give, a uh, 7.5. 7.5. So let's recap the scores. 8.75. 8 8.75. 8.5. 8.5. 8.0. 8.0. And a 7.5. Yeah. If we can agree that it's a good burger, right. yeah. it is a good. I mean, burger. it's a good burger. And the price you said you mentioned, the I don't know what the price is, but it's Walmart. I can't imagine it'd be too expensive yeah. coming from yeah. Walmart. And this is the kind of burger that Paul can have ten of these yeah. and still run a marathon. <laughs> it's lean, right? Right, Paul. I mean, yeah. this is this is good. This At is least he wasn't disappointed today. It was a good. I mean, yeah, 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 last, last week he would have been disappointed. I mean, yeah, it's a, last week, yeah, I would have just. It's like, like, when I the video, that's, uh, when this I is the kind of burger that during quarantine, that if you're home. And you have one of these with your family and a beer, and you kick back, you feel good, sure. you yep. chill. You don't get exactly. sick. You don't no, get no, sick. No, no. And then, like Volta yeah. says, you, and then you can go yeah. back to shaving that mustache, trimming <laughs> it, and, and manscaping. And we're going to celebrate today with a cheap shot Fireball. Oh, man. Yeah. 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 Fireball. Let me give you a fact about this. Oh, you're a fact. What I have run, you I see, see so a many of those. Little <laughs> bottles of this on the Yeah, yeah. I, I, unfortunately, it's I see really it too. bad. It's, it's very bad. So this is gonna go so right to the recycle bin yeah. after we're done. If you if you buy nips and this, don't throw it on the ground. I mean, there's recycle. no. Recycle. That kind of shows you. Wait, that kind of shows you the clientele that's buying those fireballs. Yes. Yeah, but we're buying it too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Which is not very yeah. good. Me no. I came here. Fireball. Have, um, last week I hear about this. Fabulous margarita. Oh, it was delicious. I think it's gonna be yeah, champ yeah, I know they're champagne. Champagne. Listen to me. And I this, 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 this great value. This, this, not, this great value is, a, is an average burger. <laughs> this doesn't deserve champagne yet. Fireball. <laughs> All right, let's get rid of this. Gonna We're gonna go kill glass, this today. See? All right. To Paris. All right. Hold on, I have All right. Cheers. Yeah. Fireball. Fireball.